Josiah's been taking some reps at safety. You did that earlier in your career. What is it about the nickel spot that maybe kind of relates itself to safety a little bit? Uh, it's just because it's like, I mean, it does relate a little bit in some point because in some parts of our defense, you know, his spots move or whatever, you might end up there. But at the end of the day, I mean, Josiah's been doing a really good job. And, I mean, at nickel and safety, he's shown that he can do both. And, you know, just coming from my experience from playing both, it's just making yourself show – it's showing everyone that you're, you know, you're able to play multiple positions and, you know, be able to compete at a high level at them as well. So it's just – Make, making a depth better and on a depth chart, and you know you got guys that can play in multiple positions is a good thing. What, what kind of impact do you see like Darius and, and Bradbury having, you know, on the secondary as a whole? What kind of impact do you see Bradbury and Darius having on the secondary as a whole? Uh, a great impact. I mean, you got two high-level starters and smart players. I mean, they've been in the league for quite a some time now. Slay and old ancient dust, but no, I'm playing. <laughs> but no, I mean, he's still competing at a high level, and each and every day we see them guys out here, and you know, me just watching them on film, and you know, Bradbury is playing great football right now, and Slay's playing great football right now, and they just, you know, just asking them and picking their brains each and every day, like, what do you see at this? Like, what are you doing at the top of the route, and things like that. You got two vets that's able to help you out, and that's the one, that's the thing. Them two are never like, hide anything like anytime someone comes up to them or if they see something wrong they come and speak to you about it and they fix it for you. You've seen AJ Brown take some reps inside uh, obviously a big size mismatch how do you attack a bigger player when they're inside? Uh, yeah, He's been taking some reps inside for the most part but um, I mean just be, be more physical I mean you know he's a big body so just knowing he can box you out and be able to push off you in, in, in many ways so you want to stay strong at the top, and then you don't want to be violent at the point of attack. Uh, I mean, I, I, it don't matter who's up in front of me uh, for the most part. Um, whoever I, I line up against, I love to compete for the most part. So if it's bigger, smaller, or it, it doesn't really matter to me. You've had a lot of competitive reps with Wes so far during camp. What's that match been pretty good. I mean, Quez is definitely a great matchup, uh, fast, and he got good hands. So, you know, me and Quez have been going at it for the, since the start of the camp, and now I've been seeing a little bit of different different bodies in there, but for the most part, it beat Quez. But, and, you know, he's doing really well, and, you know, I think we're competing at a high level, and we, we're getting each other better. In terms of Friday, I think the coaches are still deciding how much you guys are going to play, how much the starters are going to play. How, what would you prefer in terms of playing time on, on Friday, Friday's preseason game? Uh, Friday game. Uh, I, I don't know. I, I haven't even been. We haven't even been told anything like that. So I don't really know. I'm just taking it day by day, making sure I know what I'm doing out here on the field, and making sure I'm prepared and ready for Friday. If you had to choose, though, what would you like to play? A decent amount on Friday, or at least a little bit on Friday? Yeah, I mean, I'm always down to compete. <laughs> yeah, I'm not ever really. If I really want to sit out at anything, so if I'm out there, I'm out there, and I'm ready to go. How beneficial are the joint practices? If you're not getting a lot of reps in the preseason games, uh, they really. I mean, every rep at practice is beneficial for the most part. Um, joint practice just making it a lot better, you know, because you're going against a different team and they're running in different offenses and things like that. You're not going against your set, your guys, so you know, I think it's beneficial and it's and it's fun. You know, you out there, you competing for just, what an hour and a half, an hour and forty straight, and it's just all competition. You know, even on special teams, you know, you you're going against a different color, so. You know that that's definitely fun, and you know it gives, it shows the guys it gives the guys to show their ability and what they can do against different people. All right, thanks, Bob. Thanks, Bob.